Today as well. You know, today, maybe you had some uh, Bob Evans. It's the 30th day of May 2021, the day before Memorial Day, the day that we celebrate those who have sacrificed and gave their lives for this, this freedom that we have here in this country, America, the United States of. I thank God for every active duty, every serviceman throughout history, every service woman throughout history, especially those who pay the ultimate price for us to be here today and to have what we have, what we cherish. We must fight for true equality here in this country because we deserve it. We deserve it. We got to continue to keep up the good fight for it. This George Floyd police accountability, police transparency, police acting like they got some kind of honor some kind of sense this police act this police reform act needs to pass and these politicians who have been elected to represent us must do what it is that they're supposed to do and push for this I'm talking about from the top down Joe Biden, Kamala Harris they're supposed to be Working for us, doing what it is that we need for them to do for the greater good. And that means everything. This needs to pass. We don't need to wait for any kind of Republican that doesn't have our best interest at heart. Because we have the White House. We have Congress. The House. And we got the VP. We got the deciding vote. Kamala Harris. We deserve justice. I'm at the port right now on Sunday. I'm at work in Wilmington on Sunday doing what it is that I have to do today. I called up the tape last night to see if there was work here today and they said that there was. They said it was a car ship, so I'm down here driving cars onto a ship. Sunday time and a half. One of the ministers in my life told me that my young years, my able-bodied years, I gotta use to make money can't be in church every Sunday. It's not possible. I've, I've missed a couple Sundays. I missed a few. I'm, I'm on a street. I think I missed a month of Sundays now at work. But I made some money. We need money. Got to pay bills. I got to pay for insurance. I thank God that I don't have a car note that I have to pay. But I, um... I'm here. So today, this week we, we celebrated a year of unrest, a year of justice, seeking protest and petitions, a year of activists becoming activists, people becoming who it is that they're meant to be in this time. This movement, this past year, has really grown. Folks have become emboldened and have joined this effort to call for change, to call for peace here in this country. George Floyd, nine minutes and some odd seconds, 10 minutes, Let's just say 10 minutes. <sighs> On video.
Salute to the young lady that recorded all that. Not even a grown woman. Teenage girl. You know, if she's black, a lot of times they want to say young woman when we're talking about black people. Young man when we're talking about black children, black boys. This young girl, not even a woman, recorded this video that changed this nation. I pray that this George Floyd bill will be passed so that that video will mean that much more. Keep up the good fight.